GarageBand for iPad and iPhone only gives you 8 bars to work with by default. Luckily, you have the option to not only extend the length of your projects almost indefinitely, but also organize it into clearly defined sections. In this quick tip, I'll show you how. Okay, first off, tap the song section button. It's this wee plus icon in the top corner. To have your project match the length of your recordings, simply tap section A, and then tap the automatic toggle switch here. Your project will be one big section that will last as long as you choose to record into it. To add separate sections to use as intros, verses, choruses, etc., open the song sections controls and tap add. The new empty section is added after the last section. Tap anywhere in Tracks View to close the song section controls, or you can keep adding new sections as you wish. To change the length of a section, open the song section controls again, and then tap the Inspector button next to the section name you want to make longer. Tap the up or down arrow next to Manual to lengthen or shorten the section incrementally by bars. You can swipe vertically to change it in larger increments if you wish. You can play different sections by swiping left or right in the tracks view until you get to your desired section. Or you can open the song section controls, then choose the section you want to play. To play all the sections in the song, choose all sections. Finally, if you want to change the order of your sections, open the song section controls again, and then tap edit. Drag a section up or down in the list by the handle on its right edge. It's those three horizontal lines there. And when you're finished, tap done. That'll about do it for this quick tip. I've been Patrick from thegaragebandguide.com and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.